Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Oh God, come to our aid. O oh Lord, may haste to help us. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Lord, who through all these forty days for us did fast and pray, teach us with me to mourn our sins and close by thee to stay. As thou with Satan didst contend and didst the victory win, O oh, give us strength in thee to fight, in thee to conquer sin. As thirst and hunger thou didst fare, so teach us gracious Lord to die to self and daily live by thy most holy word. And through these days of penitence and through thy passion They will mourn for him as for an only son, since it is the innocent one of the Lord who has been slain. Hear my voice, O God, as I complain. Guard my life from dread of the foe. Hide me from the band of the wicked, from the trunk of those who do evil. They sharpen their tongues like swords, they aim bitter words like arrows to shoot at the innocent from ambush, shooting suddenly and recklessly. They shame their evil course. They conspire to lay secret snares. They say, who will see us, who can search out our crimes? He will search who searches the mind and knows the depths of the heart. God has shot them with his arrow and dealt them sudden wounds. Their own tongue has brought them to ruin, and all who see them mock. Then will all men fear. They will tell what God has done. They will understand God's deeds. They just will rejoice in the Lord and fly to him for refuge. All the upright hearts will glory. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, War without end. Amen. They will mourn for him as for an only son, since it is the innocent one of the Lord who has been slain. Save my soul from the gates of hell, Lord. I said, in the noontide of my days I must depart. I am consigned to the gates of Sheol for the rest of my years. I said, I shall not see the Lord in the land of the living. I shall look upon man no more among the inhabitants of the world. My dwelling is plucked, and up, plucked up and removed from me like a shepherd's tent. Like a weaver I have rolled up my life. He cuts me off from the loom. From day to night you bring me to the end. I cry for help until morning. Like a lion, he breaks all my bones. From day to night, you bring me to an end. Like a swallow or a crane, I clamor. I moan like a dove. My eyes are weary with looking upward. O oh Lord, I am oppressed. Be my security. Lo, it was my welfare that I had great bitterness. But you have held back my life from the pit of destruction. For you have cast all my sins behind your back. 
For Sheol cannot thank you, that cannot praise you. Those who go down to the pit cannot hope for your faithfulness. The living, the living, we thank you, as I do this day. The Father makes known the children your faithfulness. The Lord will save me, and we will sing a string to the stringed instruments all the days of our life at the house of the Lord. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Save my soul from the gates of hell, Lord. I was dead, and now I am to live forever and ever, and I hold the keys of death and of hell. Praise God in his holy place. Praise him in his mighty heavens. Praise him for his power of deeds. Praise his surprising greatness. Oh, praise praise him him with sound of trumpet. trumpet. Praise Praise him with with lute and harp. Praise Praise him with timbrel and dance. Praise him with strings and pipes. Oh, praise him with resounding cymbals. Praise him with clashing of cymbals. Let everything that lives and that breathes give praise to the Lord. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. I was was dead, and and now now I am to live forever and and ever. I hold hold the keys of of death and of of hell. hell. A reading from the prophet Hosea. The Lord says this, They will search for me in their misery. Come, let us return to the Lord. He has torn us to pieces, but he will heal us. He has struck us down, but he will bandage our wounds. After a day or two, he will bring us back to life. On the third day, he will raise us, and we shall live in his presence. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Christ humbled himself for us and in obedience accepted that even that on a cross. Therefore God raised him to the heights and gave him the name which is above all other names. Save us, Savior of the world. By your cross and the shielding of your blood, you have redeemed us. Come to help us, Lord our God. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior in the house of David, his servant. As he promised by the lips of holy men, those who were his prophets from of old. A Savior who would free us from our foes, from the hands of all who hate us. So his love for our fathers is fulfilled, and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father to grant us that free from fear and safe from the hands of our foes, we might serve him in holiness and justice all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him to make known to his people their salvation through forgiveness of all their sins, the loving kindness of the heart of our God, who visits us like the dawn from on high. 
He will give light to those in darkness, those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Save us, Savior of the world, by your cross and the shedding of your blood, you have redeemed us. Come to help us, Lord our God. Let us pray to our Redeemer, who suffered for us, was buried, and rose from the dead. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ our Lord, you saw your mother standing by the cross. May we share your saving passion in our time of suffering. Lord, Lord, Lord have, have mercy on us. Christ, our Savior, you died like a grain of wheat falling into the ground. Gather us to yourself in the harvest of redemption. Lord, Lord have, have mercy on us. Christ, our Shepherd, laying in the tomb, you were hidden from men. Teach us to love our real life which is hidden with you in God. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, the new Adam, you went down into the world of the dead to free the just. May those who are dead in sin hear your voice and live. Lord, have mercy on us. Son of the living God, you were buried with, we were buried with you in baptism. Let us rise with you alive to God forever. Lord, Lord, have, have mercy, mercy on, on us. Our Father, who art, who art in heaven, hallowed, hallowed be thy, thy name. Thy, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, be done on, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Almighty, ever-living God, whose only begotten Son descended to the realm of the dead and rose from there to glory. Grant that your faithful people who were buried with him in baptism may be, by his resurrection obtain eternal life, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Thank you, all of you, for praying together. I invite you to today's Vigil Mass at 9 p.m. I wish you all a happy day. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.
you are never alone. We are always there to pray for you.